I am Sudhish Gajanukar. This is the type 2 problem. Type 2 problem in the V belt. What is the difference between the type 1 and type 2? Here what happened? The mu is not given here. Not given. And alpha is not given. Therefore, this method we have to add up in order to find out number of belts. That is, I we have to find out. Here. I. What is the formula for finding the I here? I is nothing but this is the formula I am giving to use. This is the I. I is equal to this is the formula I am going to use. I is equal to N F A divided by N star F N star F C F T. This is the formula I am going to use here in order to find out uh, number of plies when mu and alpha is not given. This is the one more method and which is a very more, very important method and most of them this question will be arrived in the video. Okay, this is the number of plies we have to find out. When we have, when we have to go for this for, uh, formula when mu is not given alpha is not given. Now, first one, whatever the data is I want to write here. Newton, 50 Newton is given, n is equal to or p is equal to 50 Newton, 50 kilowatt, sorry, 50 kilowatt, mode RPM they are given as, if your motor is required to run N1 or NS they are given it, 144 RPM, required to drive by compressor through a V-belt and uh, the pitch diameter of the compressor is Diameter the argument the 250 mm and one more D or larger D 800 mm. It is nothing but D2, this is nothing but D1. Approximate center distance C is given 1.5 meter, it is nothing but 1500 mm. It's 1500 mm. This much data they have given it. Okay, we have to find out one by one in order to fulfill this requirement in order to get number of belt. Now first n is known. We have to we don't know about the FA. FA can be obtained. Now how the FA is obtained? FA, FA is obtained on the table 21.28. FC 21.27. FD 21.26. These are the table you have to refer in the with respect to in order to get I here. Before reaching this formula, first you have to find out DE value. This is what this formula is very important. Okay. Step one N1 D1 is equal to N2 D2. N1 divided by D2 divided by D1. Therefore, N1 is a thing but 1440 divided by N2 N2 D2 is a thing but 800 divided by 250 therefore N2 will be 450 RPM 450 RPM after getting this value step 1 have to substitute in this formula d is equal to d is equal to dp into fb here dp is nothing but your d1 okay d1 but we don't know fp fp how to find out the fp they have said it you have to refer the table 21 dash 25 page number 21.46 21.50 this is the table correction factor for industrial service this is your FP this is the FP here so the FA this is the FA now in the FA in exam if they are not given any data you have to assume medium duty over 10 hours to 16 hours 1.2 1.2 I will consider that one FA
if I sorry I made a mistake here I have to, instead of that one I have to go for FB FB is here sorry FB is here this is the FB I require I went for the FA this one I went but actually I have to go for FB FB is nothing but this is the FB for finding the FB what we require speed ratio is required first find out the speed ratio n1 divided by n2 we have to find out 1440 divided by 450. The answer will be 3.2. The speed ratio 3.2 over this one is FP, where P is nothing but 1.14. FB is equal to 1.14. Substitute in this formula. D is equal to D1 is nothing but D1 is nothing but 250 into 250 into 1.14. The answer will be 285 ml. Now, once you get 285 ml, again you have to go back to page number 21.13. Here, after getting here, you have to reach maximum value of DP. It is uh, 285. 285 is nothing but it lies here, in between here. Therefore, I have to select C, cross section C. I have to select cross section C. If it lies in between here, I have to go for higher end. Therefore, I will select the cross section C. Belt cross section C. Once you get the C, once you get the C, you have to, you have to follow this formula now. Now, first, once you get the C, you have to follow this formula. Now, before this one, N is known, N star we have to find out. How to obtain the n star? The n star is because the cross section C has the n star. Write down this formula n star is equal to V 1.47 divided by V is equal to 0 0.09 minus 14.143.27 divided by DE minus 2.34 v square divided by what? 10 to 4 what is velocity here velocity they have given it no we have to find out the velocity v velocity is nothing but pi d1 n1 divided by 60,000 pi d1 is nothing but here 250 into n1 1440 divided by 60,000. 60,000. The answer will be 18.84 meter per second. Now substitute V value here. N star is equal to 18.84 1.47 divided by 18.84 minus 14 143.27 divided by DE is nothing but 285 DE is nothing but 285 minus 234.V value will be 18.84 whole square divided by 10 to 4 the total answer for this one is 10.22 kilowatt 22 kilowatt ok now N is known N star is known now we have to find out the FA value FA value again you have to follow the table here this is the FA value service factor in the exam they are not given in the exam in the question paper they are not mentioned means you have to assume medium duty this is a medium duty in the medium duty you have to consider 10 hours 16 10 hours to 16 hours that is 1.2 1.2 FA is nothing but question mark but I have referred the table 21.28 page number 21.50 therefore FA is nothing but 1.1 assume medium duty medium duty 10 hours to 16 hours next what we have to find out 
next as per the data fa is over fc we have to find out fc make it the fc as a question mark go for finding the fc what is fc here this is the fc here but we know the cross section area c but we don't know the nominal length belt first find out the nominal length how to obtain the nominal length the formula again obtain here the nominal pitch of the length of the belt write down this formula and substitute the value we will get l value i'll write that formula l is equal to 2c plus pi by 2 d plus d plus d minus small d whole square divided by 4c this is the formula i am going to write and substitute the value substitute the value 2 into 1500 plus pi by 2 800 plus 250 800 minus 250 whole square divided by 4 into 1500 answer will be answer 4699.75 mm again go back to table now before going for this table you have to refer this table now now in this table 46 46 c c 46 cc 46 the nearest value the nearest value okay this is the 46 to 8 i will consider this is the 46 to 8 it is very important it is 46 to 8 the nominal inside length is 4 5 7 2. 4.4572 4, 4, 4, this one is actual value once you know this one go to this table 22.27 here go for searching of 4625 46 sorry uh, you have to search value 4572 4572 c it is 1.05 1.05 now fc for this one is 1.05 now we have to find out what now we have to find out one more term fd FD we have to find out this is the FD here FD sorry this is the FD correction factor of the arc of contact FD this is FD in order to find out the FD we have to find out the angle of contact how to find out the angle of contact This is the formula for finding the angle of contact here. This is the formula. This is the formula. They have written is angle of contact. This formula you have to use in order to get FD value. Everything they have mentioned it with respect to table. No need to mug up. This formula you have to write it down. Write it down and find out the value here. Theta is equal to theta is equal to 2 cos inverse d by d divided by 2c 2 cos inverse 800 minus 250 divided by 2 into 1500 the answer will be 158.87 approximately 160 degree. 160 degree now angle of contact 
this is the angle of contact 160 160 and you have to go for vv belt every time you have to go for vv vv you have to go for okay every time you have to select vv now 160 it is uh, F, fd value is 0 0.95 0 0.95 now substitute in formula i is equal to 50 into 1.2 divided by 10.22 into 1.05 into 0 0.95 5.88 approximately 6 bit Next, you have to find out the correct center distance. Distance. How to open this value? Again, you have to go back to this uh, page 21.13. This is the formula for correct center distance. Write it out. C is equal to C is equal to L by 4 minus pi d plus d divided by 4 plus root L by 4 minus pi d plus d whole square divided by 8 sorry 8 minus d by d whole square divided by 8 now what is the L value the obtained the actual value the actual value this is value actual value you have to write here 4 5 7 2 divided by 4 minus pi four five seven two Okay, just wait a minute. I made a mistake here. This is your actual value, not this one. This is your actual value. This is the actual value you have to write here. 4628 divided by 4 divided by 4 minus pi 800 plus 250 divided by 8 250 divided by 8 is the 8 plus root 4628 divided by 4 minus pi 800 plus 250 divided by 8 minus 800 800 minus 250 whole square divided by 8 the obtained answer will be c is equal to 1463.5 mm One four six three point five mm. This is the the C value which is obtained, and this C value almost near to the given C value. Almost near to the given C value. So this C value is almost near to the given C value. That means whatever you have done it, it is correct. Next, specification of the V belt. Specification of the V belt. Now to go for the specification of the V belt is the specification. 
in the specification it's a cross section area c you have to cross write the cross section area c cross section area c will write cross section area c here nominal length or w is 22 and thickness t is 14 that means you have to draw the diagram in this way this is 22 this is 14 c 22 14 you have to write this one is 22 this one is 14 the angle will be 40 of the 40 whatever the value oh, it should be 40 okay there is no alpha here it should be a 40 there is no alpha here. okay i am satish thank you very much